Anyway, the match begins. It's Kurt Angle and William Regal versus Chris Benoit and Rikishi. This match was the fucking best. Yeah. yeah. This is what we're missing today. Mm -hmm. Good, funny comedy in the context of a great wrestling match that doesn't involve the announcers doing their fake laughing or them having to explain the joke to you. Kurt is running wild, and he hits the angle slam, but he doesn't make a cover. <laughs> and they're wondering, why isn't Kurt making this cover here? And Kurt's got his hands on his head. He's like, God damn it! And he's just pacing back and forth, and he starts looking down at Benoit's crotch. Mm -hmm. Nobody has to say anything. Everybody knows what's happening. And Kurt starts to get down... And then he stands up again. God, I can't do it. His face, he's practically in tears. I can't do it, but I've got to get my medals. <laughs> and he reaches and he lifts and he peeks in and he probably lifts his head up again. Fans are fucking dying. And finally, he fucking sticks his hand all the way in and he grabs the medals out and he holds them up in the air and he starts celebrating. But he's an idiot. Yes. <laughs> and so he has his back turned. <laughs> Benoit... <laughs> Right, right. Before that, you missed, yeah, you missed a, you missed. He's a an great idiot. Spot. He's so excited that he kisses the medals. Yes, and then yes. he didn't remembers where they were. Yes, and it's the he does a regal phase. Yes. Then he turns around like an idiot. Benoit yes. puts him in the cross phase, and Benoit has the medals in his hand, his tapping hand, his Angle only this. available hand. Angle yes, does. and he knows. God damn it! I've got to tap, but my fucking medals, <laughs> and. He's holding, his hands are shaking. He's weeping. And his face is completely covered because he's in the cross face. But you can see one eye yes. glance at his medals. <laughs> he looks at them one last time. And then he fucking taps. Benoit jumps up. He takes the medals. He runs off. This was so awesome. Yes. This was like an all-time great moment on Raw that nobody ever talks about. It was but a if I would have had time, in fact, I probably will go back and watch it again when the show is over. It was so good. These guys the, are the greatest. <laughs> Benoit and Angle were, in fact, an awesome, awesome pair. Did you remember this, Brian? When this started unfold, did you, did you remember where it went? I didn't remember. Okay. I did vividly, in part because you went on a passion to rant in Figure Four Weekly Newsletter. Now, I won't lie. I went back and read it, and frankly, the speech you just gave is more exciting than what you wrote down 20 years ago. <laughs> That's impossible, I think. But you did declare it was time for a speech. Whoever booked this segment is a genius, a literal genius. I so, uh, yes. stand by that here 19 years later. but the, the, This the, was genius. This is an, an, an all-time great Kurt Angle performance. Just the part where he's in the crossface, he can't move anything. Because his body, of course, is pinned down by Benoit. His arm is trapped. His head is trapped. His face is trapped. You see eye motion. And his other hand is holding up the medals in his fist so he can't tap. And just by eye motion alone, you see how much this hurts him to do, how much it kills him to release these medals so he can tap out to the cross face. It's brilliant comedy. It's brilliant comedy. It's the greatest. And Absolutely the greatest. And he taps... And Benoit gets the medals back, and they're still having a match on Sunday. It's a fucking match that involves William Regal, and somehow he's, I don't want to say the least funny guy in the match, but yeah. he may as well not even be there. It's the Chris Benoit and Kurt Angle comedy show, and it, it was so great. It was the Angle comedy show. Benoit was just well, there yes. to wrestle. And we should stress, well, we should stress this. Comedy, Vinny, comedy needs a straight man. Yes. And let me tell you what Chris Benoit is. A he was a straight man. man. Yes. So the the key to all this is this, as as great as this comedy was, they did ten minutes of really awesome wrestling beforehand. <laughs> so the comedy None was of that mad. I don't realize that in the long run. No, no all, all anyone's going to remember is the the stuff with Angle at the end. But just a, a great segment of wrestling television here. And you know what else was great about it? This is also missing today. Because today it's all about we just got to get heat every single fucking solitary week. Also and then true. One, once every 24 weeks, somebody, some babyface wins, and then you just fucking beat him down again. This is what everybody loved about Vince McMahon and Steve Austin. 
Mm-hmm. Every single week, Kurt Angle plans something, and he gets foiled. And the next week, he's got another plan, and he gets foiled. Every single time. He's the coyote. I love it. Yeah, exactly. Yes! He's the coyote. Exactly. 